What's up guys, it's Larry the Mortgage Guy, your sales disruptor. I'm gonna talk about friends lists and what you can do to maximize it. Uh, actually, I'm gonna focus on organization, okay? I'm not sure if you knew this, but you can actually categorize your friends, meaning you can actually add your friend to a specific group. I think they first start off with like friends, high school, acquaintances, coworkers, or whatever, but you actually create your friends list. Like, I'll give you an example. I work with a lot of realtors, so I actually have a category just for realtors. The cool thing about that is you can actually go to your friends list and select the category and you can actually only see their feed. Also, you can send a post or a message or whatever and select just that category. So if I have something I want to talk to my realtors about, instead of blabbing it to everybody who might not be interested, I can select specifically just the realtors. Uh, if you don't know about this uh, feature, it's a game changer and you should probably explore it today. Again, you can create and organize your own categories for your friends. It's especially useful whenever you want to uh, put out a private uh post and you don't want specific people to look at you can actually put those people in a certain category like not good enough to see my private post category right <laughs> but uh, my favorite feature about it is if you go to the actual organization section and you click that specific group it will show just those people it will show just their feeds and it'll show you who's on that list that way you can I mean if you want to focus your energy on a specific category you can instead of like digging through all the news feeds and trying to select your friends one at a time, all right? Uh, hopefully that gave you some value. This is Larry the Mortgage Guy, your sales disruptor. I'm out.